respected students welcome back everyone today's video is completely different video and the confusion of students that exactly how much time is required to learn power bi to get job okay there are many students who has done graduation in 2015 18 20 something and they are thinking to learn the power bi or some of them are right now learning or some of them have already completed their course from any reputed institute or from any online might be learning from youtube or somewhere else so today i will explain you properly exactly how much time is required to learn power bi to get a job as a fresher also and as an experienced also okay properly everything i am going to explain it in this video so make sure you are watching or listening this video till the end and all your doubts mark my words all your doubts will be cleared the video will be bigger more than 10 minutes so make sure properly you are listening to the video so before starting the video if you are new on our channel make sure you are subscribing and pressing bell icon for all upcoming videos and follow us on social media especially instagram telegram all the some of the articles or job openings quizzes everything is there okay so let's start with the video so before starting the video first thing let me make you clear first thing if you are applying or if you are learning power bi and if you want to do job in data analytics field or as a power bi developer whether you are a fresher or whether you are experienced you must know sql okay you must know sql earlier it was like that if you are applying as a fresher in 2020-21 when demand for power bi was too good even today also it is there but supply was very less okay but now supply has been increased for power bi many institutes are there they are teaching power bi course or many trainers are also there they are teaching power bi okay so even uh, if you are a fresher you must know SQL along with Power BI. Experience wale ko to matlab aana hi chahiye. But even if you are fresher, then also you must know Power BI plus SQL. So if you are learning right now Power BI or if you have learned, make sure that you know Power BI plus SQL. So what is required to get a job as a Power BI developer? See in bold I have written in this third line, Power BI you must know. SQL you must know data concepts and basic Excel. Okay? Data concepts like database or data warehousing concepts, types of data, what is dimension table, fact table, okay? these types of concepts. Okay? So let's start with the first point. Let me make you clear that biggest joke of decade, like this I have written here actually, but this is actually the biggest joke of decade in data analytics industry. See, in data analytics industry, there are top three tools in the world and India. Third one is ClickSense. No doubt it is great. Even I had work on that tool. It is really great tool, no doubt. Second is Tableau in India. And first is Power BI in India. And in world, uh, second is Power BI. But uh, first is Tableau. The reason why I am telling first is Tableau. Because in Western countries, mostly in US, UK, Tableau is preferred rather than Power BI, but not much, but somewhere Tableau has taken two steps ahead in Western countries, but, but in India, completely Power BI is dominating, completely, let me be frank, okay, so first point which was there, biggest joke of decade is learn Power BI in 5 to 10 days, no, you can't learn Power BI in 5 to 10 days, whether you are applying as a fresher, and if you are applying as an experience, and if you are learning for one and two weeks, and you are thinking that you will easily crack the interview let me be frank that you are the means completely on means uh, wrong what we say wrong training or uh, biggest mistake you are doing no you can't learn power bi in one or two weeks whether you are applying as a fresher whether you are applying as an experience okay so remove these concepts only basic things what is visualization how to fetch data that to uh, from that excel or csv somewhere you will uh, see but in real time experience real time projects data is fetched from sql data is fetched from snowflake data is fetched from azure data is fetched from 
web apis data is fetched from google analytics mostly the data is fetched from sql or snowflake in real time process that to from import mode connectivity mode okay so everything is there so you can't learn power bi in 5 to 10 days it is not going to happen whether you are fresher or experienced okay second point now required are skills compulsory to get job as a power bi developer see if you are a fresher na so power bi plus sql will help you no doubt little bit of data concept if you know what is uh, numerical data and categorical data somewhere basic concept no issue no issue but if you are applying as a experience like 2 years 3 years 4 years see power bi to you should know end to end if more than 3 years of experience for 2 years okay ठीक है बट फॉर थ्री मोर देन थ्री इयर्स ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस पावर बी आई एंड टू एंड व्हेन आई से एंड टू एंड इन पावर बी आई इट मींस दैट पावर क्वेरी प्लस पावर बी आई डेस्कटॉप प्लस पावर बी आई सर्विस ठीक है पावर बी आई सर्विस इज इंपॉर्टेंट नो डाउट मेनी स्टूडेंट्स आई हैव ऑब्जर्व दैट दे लर्न पावर क्वेरी वेरी प्रॉपर्ली हां दे लर्न पावर बी आई डेस्कटॉप and they ignore power bi service but power bi service is very important because their gateway is there their subscription is there their data alert is there their schedule refresh the most important thing when database team is ingesting data okay that time uh, schedule refresh is happening in power bi service and after that only your power bi reports will reflect with latest dates that is today's date so schedule refresh gateway subscription everything is power bi service is very important when it comes to when you are more than 3 4 years of experience you can even get member access in the power bi service okay so sql also you must know theek hai but let me be frank if you are working in professional company na theek hai large scale mega scale or even mid scale like 1000 2000 people's company you will have sql developer in your team no doubt sql developer will be there in your team but the reason why you should know sql because whatever view or store procedure you are fetching na that you should be able to read it okay what that how the view was created what the logic was there which join was used okay what ranking they have given what conditions they have applied or at least column names you can check or if you have to do concatenation like this things are there data concept why you you should be able to read the data theek hai you should be able to read the data basic excel why because if you are using export functionality no doubt your client is going to use that export functionality theek hai so if you want to check some and everything you can check in sql as well for example if you have found that your total sale is 10000 theek hai so you will verify that I uh, means your validation QA engineer who is there, he will validate in SQL also. But you can also do unit testing of your Power BI report with SQL and Excel. So that's the reason why Excel is needed with Excel with pivot function. You can check that. Okay. So these four things are required if you are applying as a experienced three years and as a for a fresher or one year Power BI SQL is okay. in power bi if you exclude power bi service for a fresher then it then also it is okay theek hai and if you are more than 3 4 years of experience and if you know little bit of power apps power automate ssis little bit of python mark my words it will really help you and you, it will make your resume so stronger no doubt theek hai but first power bi you should be pro in power bi you should know pro power bi sql proper and then go to that power apps and power automate python and all all those things okay now fourth point is to learn power bi sql basics for example if someone is going to start the course on 1st january okay so if he want to learn power bi sql basics then two months will be required if daily one hour he is preparing and Uh, if he want to prepare in uh, like one month, then daily two or two point five hours he will require, and after that he can apply as a fresher. But also in that, how what you uh, means what things you are learning? Like in Power BI, you should learn Power Query, mostly seventy eighty parts. Modeling also uh, Star Schema, Snowflake Schema, Connectivity Modes you should know, Tags you should know, Visualization eight ten Visualization which are important that you should know. how to publish the report how to share with clients with that embedded link theek okay? hai i have made the end to end report uh, end to end video on power bi service you can check that also 
okay so if you want to learn power by sql at basic level if uh, you have means assume that two months uh, you are going to prepare then daily one hour of uh, learning and after that 30 minutes 40 minutes revision you can do and if you want to learn in like one month only then daily two hours or 2.5 hours you can work on after that one hour revision you can do and you can be prepared for a fresher job okay but to learn power bi sql intermediate level at intermediate level or more than intermediate level three to four months are required daily two hours and after that one month of proper revision is required okay because when you are applying as a experience of two years three years four years whatever it is for example if you have converted experience or anything else then see if three four months you are learning daily two hours even after that proper one month of revision is required because you must know power bi desktop in that power bi desktop only many things are there modeling is there visualization in that visualization custom visualization dax is there dax are of five to six types okay even power query many conditional column append merge many things are there custom column column from example duplicate reference okay advanced editor parameters in power via service six to seven important points are there in sql view store procedure join subset many things are there even data concept eight to ten data concepts are there of database data warehousing basic excel you should know so proper one month of revision is also required if you are doing course from somewhere else and if your course is completed even if you are able to do uh, if you uh, if you are able to know all the things in power bi make sure proper revision you are doing see i have written here one month if your grasping power is good then you can do 10 days of also revision no doubt but the reason why i'm telling the one who are applying as an experience the reason why i'm telling do revision because your first two to three interviews are most important if your two to three interviews first two to three interviews if you are able to easily crack first one or two rounds in that interviews now your confidence level will be increased like 100 to 100 percent but in first three interviews if you will get rejected somewhere your willpower your willpower will be less it will really affect you so if you are applying as a experience like two to four years whatever you are whatever experience you are having make sure proper revision you are doing i am assuming this thing that you are good at soft skills when it comes to soft skills confidence and communication okay your communication not should be that it means english should be pro no doubt but at least if you are able to speak technically and if your confidence is good okay you will easily crack experience uh, interviews also but make sure properly at least two weeks three weeks of proper revision you are doing first two to three interviews are really very important it is going to shape your all interview journey and the most important thing right now in this video i am telling you no one is going to tell you the most important thing and that line is your real preparation or your real study starts when you start giving the interviews okay again i am repeating your real study your real preparation starts when you start giving the interviews at the time of course no doubt you are learning you are learning many things your trainer or from wherever you are learning he is teaching you properly many things no doubt but your real preparation starts when you start giving the interviews real time interviews are that too not mock interviews anything real time company interviews okay so those are very important also after your interview is completed make sure you are no doubting all the questions and for example he has asked you 10 uh, 20 questions and you were able to answer 13 14 rest six questions which you were not able to answer search on internet or do anything or ask me okay you can do this thing uh, and uh, and last point is uh, it is quite different to learn power bi at advanced level or expert level uh, two three years of uh, real time experience is required with about three to five projects you must have work on 
so after 2 3 5 years of real time experience now you can easily become power bi pro no doubt because you have seen you might then you will then see many things in that 2 3 years or 3 to 5 project many clients you might have seen like indian clients foreign clients you might have conversation with them many brs documents uh, then end to end power bi reports your data source uh, would be different like sql snowflake azure web web, web API in all different projects. So to become Power BI advanced level or expert, real time experience is only required. That two more than three to five projects are huh? different. Different three to five projects like one of finance domain, one of logistics, one of e-commerce like this. Okay. So see, I cleared many doubts in this video properly. If you have listened till end, many doubts I have cleared. Even if you are having any kind of doubt, doubt, make sure you are commenting within one or two hours of uh, within one or two hours I will reply to your comment. And if you have any other doubt or you have to talk to me personally, message me on Instagram. Okay? Subscribe my channel and press bell icon for all upcoming videos. Follow us on social media, especially Instagram and Telegram. Okay? Thanks for watching till end, everyone. Thank you.